Welcome to a challenge log made by Bill Bacardi. It's his 211th challenge log. Wow, so many challenge logs. Pretty cool. And it was sent to me by Logmania. So both of you, thank you very much for the log. The bidding looks like this. Pretty drastic. <clears throat> and um, I will not show you that the log works with the key because the log likes to eat the key and will not spit it out again. So I'll not do that, but I hope that I can show you a picking. I picked it once off camera and it was not too difficult but then trying to pick it on camera didn't work so I have to try again. Alright, I use this very deep hook because there's quite a distance to overcome here in this keyway and it's a pretty straight keyway so should not be a problem with the keyway. <laughs> um, Let's see, I start on one and it dropped into a false set. There's count rotation from one and got it. Two, count rotation. Click and got it, oops, lost the tension. And one, one is still good. So click little click from three. How about four? I think there is count rotation from four. Yep. And it feels set. So five. There's only warding here in the back. Okay, let's see. One. One is good. Two is no. Oh, Two gives feedback again. Nice, that was a spool. <laughs> and open. Uh, that was quick. Didn't expect that. But I'll take it. So let's see. Here we have the. Ah, I locked it back up. But you have seen it was picked. So let's take it apart and look at the pins. Now I can show you that the key works. Oh. It has not only trouble to come out, it has also trouble to come in. Feels very mm, it feels springy here. Oh, I don't want to force it. Well, let's take it apart and look at the pins and perhaps modifications. Oh, that's a problem, because um, if I cannot get the key in to turn the plug, um, I cannot take it apart. So, either I managed to get the key in or I have to pick it again. The, the key was in when I get it, when I got it, when I received it. I had to um, we had to pull it out after, re, uh, after disassembling. So what I can try to do is I can try to push down the pins first before I insert the key. Let's see if this helps.
Oops, and it's open. Ha! How about that? What was that? Why was this so easy this time? Maybe the pins were set from the from the key already? Well, this is a mysterious lock. So now I take my follower. And here we go. We can see a lot of oops, sorry. You can see a lot of modifications uh, to the plug, counter milling and threading. But now I think I should be able to slide in the key. Yeah, you can see it clears the shear line. One is standard. Two is standard, three is standard, four is standard, and five is serrated. Four isn't standard, four is reduced, and um, two is also reduced. So here are the plug modifications again counter milling in one and three, and threading in five. All right, let's go to the drivers. One is a spool, very sharp edge. Oops, you couldn't see that, sorry. Ah, two is stuck. Three is also stuck. Four is a spool. And five is also stuck. Okay. So, very interesting. You can see, you can look inside. Hmm. Okay, let's try to get these pins out. Start with two. It's not wanting. Three. Three is only a spring. Ha. Huh. getting more and more confusing so 3 is only the spring but 5 uh, has a pin but it won't come out hmm. so I take my follower and stop here at 2 flip it over and see if I can oops yeah that's Two. It's just the standard, and here we have the spring from from number one, uh, from number two, because number one is still inside. So three is empty. Now comes four. Four does not want to come out, but here we go. That's Oh no, that was, that was, ah, that was three, I think that was, oh, I, so five is still inside, so that must be three, um, okay, and then we have left only five, and here we go, there we have five. Let's see if we have modifications here. I think we don't have modifications, but now quickly look again at the pins. So here we go. We have different springs and we have um, reduced diameter here, reduced diameter here for the key pins in 2 and 4. We have spools in the driver pins in 1 and 4. and yeah, that's basically it. The rest is standard. And here again we have the modifications on the block. Yeah, one and three have um, have these counter milling. Uh, so I think I swapped these over.
because this is designed to catch in the counter milling part um, of the chamber here. And yeah, this one is an overset trap for, um, for the serrations here, for the threading. All right, so Bill Bacardi, thanks for the interesting luck and Lockmania, thanks a lot for sending it to me. And everybody else, thanks a lot for watching, happy picking and bye-bye.